Mission. Now it is finally happening. We are on the brink of making TV history. The we are in the final minutes of broadcasting in analog. At 12.30, we will officially make the switch to digital TV. The Ritter rejoins us from one of our control rooms as we count down to the big moment. Bill? Not just one of our control rooms, the place where we're going to push the switch, and you're going to see that in less than two minutes. This really is a historic moment, Ken Lori, as the hourglass on analog runs out. You know, most people in the tri-state, the overwhelming majority, already have digital. But there was always a choice in the matter. That choice is no more at, as of 1230. It is really a big way, a big change in the way we communicate. It's been more than 80 years since the invention of television, and really, few things have changed our lives more. In the first years of commercial broadcasting, TV was limited to just a few live programs and newsreels a few hours a day. Color changed the landscape dramatically, and then cable turned TV on its ear. Some of us remember when television stations used to sign off in the wee hours of the morning. Now that doesn't happen anymore. And even though analog TV is going away and the new digital Channel 7 is taking its place, Channel 7 and Eyewitness News will still be here, being part of your life for all the future history yet to come. Well, we are getting ready. I'm going to turn my back a little bit to you. We have about a 35 seconds until this happens. Now, for those of you who already have digital, who have cable, who have Fios, who have a satellite, you're not going to see anything. We are going to be here the same as we always have. For those of you who have analog, in about 25 seconds, 20 seconds or so, your signal will go off. If you have a converter box, you're going to need to reboot that converter box. We've been talking to you a lot about that. We want no viewer left behind. This is a change in the way we communicate, and in about 10 seconds, the old analog way that has ushered in television for the last 60 to 70 years will be no more. We're going to count down to four, three. Bill Beam is going to push the button over here. Two, one. Bill, push the button. Both should be off, and uh, the Digital 7 should be coming on. Digital 7 should be coming on. Now, if you have digital television already, nothing's changed. You've just seen our control room. Our digital era has now begun. Congratulations. We should be singing Old Lang Syne. Where's the, the balloons and the ball drop? I feel like Ryan Seacrest here. We have, if you have a converter box, okay, yep, it's on. I see. we hope you rescan it because right now you, ha you will not be seeing anything. If you're at, at work watching this, if you're at someone else's house watching this and you have a converter box at home, when you get home, make sure that you scan, rescan, and reboot your digital converter box, because that's the only way, because we've done this signal switch, I'm not going to uh, do all the PhD stuff to explain why you need to do this, but trust me, you need to reboot your, com your, uh, your converter box so you'll be able to see us and all your favorite Channel 7 programs and ABC and Eyewitness News beginning at 5 o'clock today. This is an historic day, Ken and Lori. Um, we are now one minute and six seconds into the total digital era. Analog is so pre-1230, and we say goodbye to that. So it I, I felt a tingle at 1230. I hope you all did, too. <laughs> Absolutely. We are still the same Channel 7, That's and we right. thank all of you for being here for all these many decades. And we hold hands and wa march together into this new yeah. digital era, and who knows what life has to hold for us. You feel kind of hip, don't you? Now? I feel so cool right now. Yeah. <laughs> you look so purely high def. Thank you, Bill. <laughs> all right, sir. And, of course, it is an exciting time. We're going to be with you every step of the way. And if you have friends and neighbors, family members who are having problems with the transition, you'll want to pass the information along. Our phones will be here staff today and all over the weekend to ensure the viewers can keep watching. The number you want to call, 212-456-7000. That's 212-456-7000. Or you can call the FCC as well. Their hotline, you go to our website. Thank you for being with us. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye.